Hi guys, if you've been following the series, you'll know that this is the first time we actually started off with a blank page, but by the end of it, we're gonna have a fully constructed triangle, so let's get into it. Okay, so here's our finished triangle. Um, as you can see, we've got our 15 centimeter line, which is horizontal, and then we've swung our arcs of 11 and eight centimeters, which met uh, somewhere above the triangle. So let's just see how this is done now from scratch. Okay, so our first step is gonna be to draw our longest side, uh, which is usually what I do first, but as long as you draw all three, it doesn't really matter, but I'm gonna start with 15. So 15 here, centimeters across, and that's our longest line. So the next step here is just gonna be to set our lens using the compass on our ruler. So if we just use the compass to first of all set eight, um, just make sure it's pretty much exactly eight there. And then we're gonna swing this arc, as I said, up above the triangle, so up here somewhere. Okay, so now we're just gonna do the same thing for 11 centimeters. So we're gonna set our compass to 11 centimeters, just make sure it's pretty much exactly 11. And we're gonna swing this up above the triangle as well, so it crosses with our arc that we swung for eight centimeters. Okay, so our final step here is gonna be to join our new intersect above the triangle with our two sides of our 15 centimeter line. So we have this length here, and then again on the left, we're gonna join this vertice here with our intersect. And that completes a triangle with lengths 15 centimeters down in the bottom, and 11 centimeters here on the right, and then eight centimeters on the left. So that's it for this construction and I'll see you next time.